think of New York fashion and there's a good chance that the first name that comes to mind is Donna Karen. That's how successfully she's identified herself with the city in which she lives and works. Donna Karen is an all-American success story, all push and plenty of chutzpah. It's a natural then that she is the last show of the entire fashion season. After four weeks of shows from Milan, Paris, London and New York, it's the lady who has helped define modern women's wear who has the last word. Donna, that, that seemed to me a collection that was a tribute to physical perfection. Am I wrong? Thank you. And I'll take it as the highest form of flattery. Um, There's probably a collection that was inspired a lot about what I can do as an artist, you know, and how to break other rules, you know, deconstruct and construct at the same time in the most simple modern way. Donna Karen for making a woman's life simpler. The fashion quest has been a search for essentials, for ways to take women into the future looking great and feeling great about themselves. I was sort of challenging myself to do to create what I thought would be a new jacket, a new suit, no, not the necessarily blazer, not the traditional power suit as we know it to be. Um, developing in an item, which is what I love to do the most. You know, not thinking about it as a full collection, but the each individual piece of, of what a collection is all about. Finding freedom in structure, exploring ways to make a woman's wardrobe simpler and more effective has been Donna Karen's inspiration. For Spring 96, she proved once again she has her own interesting idea of what women want to wear. I think it has the most flexibility of a collection that I've done in terms of it really is about a mood of a color. You know, um, the simplicity of clothes, seasonless kind of feeling. You said color is in, I heard, well I heard you say it's thin. I think it's accents of color. I think it's, a color is an expression. I think we live in Technicolor, we're a lot more exposed to it right now. You go into the city and you see the black city and you see all the neon lights and it can't help but be inspirational. Donna's clothes appeal to all women, but she seems to be gathering a real clutch of showbiz stars as followers. Dryzan's a fan, and this season Liza Minnelli came to show support. So did Goldie Horn. Do those women inspire you, or are they just really good friends? Both. Absolutely both. When Liza walked in the other night I was working, and they are good friends as well, and she put the clothes on. Liza was wearing a suit that was on the runway today, right off the rack and right on her body. For me, that, for me, was the best feeling of success that I had, because I knew that I did clothes that real women can wear.